Kenya Airways is seeking approval to manage operations at the Jomo Kenyatta International Airport. Now, in its restructuring plan aimed at boosting the airline's revenue, the airline has presented a proposal to the industry regulator, the Kenya Airports Authority, outlining how it will support and grow aviation industry in the country. Now, in the proposal, the national carrier is to form a separate entity to operate, manage, and develop JKIA for a period of 30 years. Johnny Anderson. KAA Managing Director said the authorities, Board of Directors and the management will consider the proposal on the basis of the guidelines when the PPP within the PPP Act, which incorporates the requirement of public participation. It is important to say for all the stakeholders and the public to understand <coughs> that the following in regards to KA's point of view on, on, on at this stage is that KAA will strictly follow the criteria and statutory steps outlined by the PPP Act and the PPP regulations in its review and evaluation of the PIIP that we have received from Kenya Airways.